It's Friday afternoon, 1 o'clock in the afternoon. I just pulled my ass out of bed because the dog went off like a fire alarm because the mailman was at the door because I got a package. Basically, uh, today we're, uh, we got flyer day today. Um, and, uh, friggin' flyers sucked, so all we had was, uh, staples and feature shops. So I decided to do something that a lot of you wanted me to do. I'm going to review regular feature shop and staples. But I'm also going to look at some grocery store flyers because people were like, well, you know what? Show us how much the price of food is over there in Canada because, you know, and I never even thought about this because all, I get people watching from all around the world. And, uh, you know, food doesn't cost the same in different parts of the world. So I figured, you know what? Okay. So I grabbed the flyer from uh, our local grocery stores there and threw it in and also added Walmart to the mix for funsies. So right on and welcome to my vlog. Well, you guys remember a while back when I said I had a package to ship out and uh, I didn't tell you where I was sending it. Well, a lot of you people, I don't know if you went over and subscribed, but uh, basically, Redneck Nessa was talking about coffee, how she liked coffee a lot, right? So I decided, well, she likes coffee a lot. She's in the States. Uh, she's probably too south to get Tim Hortons, because Tim Hortons is slowly working its way into the USA. However, they're working on the northern states first, and then they're pushing their way further south as they go. Now, I think she said she is from, I can't remember what state she said she's from. I think she said Mississippi. But I did a little location, store location on the areas, and there's no Hortons in, in, around that area. So now she, she moved to Connecticut, and I figured, well, maybe in Connecticut there'd be a store. Or is it New York? Well, either way, there's no store, in, there's no Hortons in New York either. Um, I think they only have them in, like, Michigan, and I can't remember the other color. They're slowly making their way into the U.S. anyway. So... What I went ahead and did, I said, well, frigate, uh, she needs to try Horton's because she was uh, she put up a video about Dunkin' Donuts and said it, it tasted really bad, even though she drank it anyway, uh, which is like me, you know, I make those Italian roast coffees or those Bisto 1919 freaking coffees out of my Keurig, and uh, even though it tastes like ass, I'm not about to throw it out because, well, frig, I love coffee, so I'm just going to hammer through it and get her into me. So I decided to be a nice guy and uh, go to our local Hortons here and pick her up a can of the fine ground so that you can make it in, in any old coffee maker. So I bought her a can of that and fired it out in the mail and she got it and cracked into it and been drinking the shit out of it and she really loves it. Like, she says it's amazing. So now she's like really anxious for a real Hortons and I told her I said well it's pretty close to the real thing like that canned Hortons is the only difference is is you know drinking it in the shop and socializing with friends that's the only reason why we go for coffee is more of the social aspect than just having coffee you know like we sit there and like Rex and I will chat about things or we come up with funny YouTube ideas or whatever and that's what we do so I went ahead and did that and well I guess she liked the coffee so much that she sent me something. And there she be, that pink box. You're probably wondering, why is it pink? Take a look at this, this is awesome tape. I'm not sure if it's packing tape or duct tape, but it's totally Hello Kitty. Totally Hello Kitty tape. That is friggin' awesome. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and crack this open and see what's going on. And I'm not gonna film opening it or anything, cause uh, yeah, I, I don't know if she actually wanted me to put it on YouTube. But I figured I could at least show you guys the box, so she sent me a, a thank you thing for the coffee, so we'll see what's going on. All I have to say is, either Stabby McFerguson needs some time with the whetstone, or you Americans make some pretty durable tape. Holy shit, that was a hard box to get into. Yeah, sure was. I'm going to say she really liked the coffee, because she kind of went overboard. Sweet. Let me show you what you got me. So if you guys subscribed to Redneck Nessa... You would have seen that she had an orange cable like this. Well, she got me a green one for charging iPhones, which is awesome. Because uh, green is my favorite color. It's one of the only colors I can see. So that's pretty sweet cable, for sure. And I have a pretty big sweet tooth when it comes to fruit-flavored things. She ended up giving me a whole shitload of candy. Got some freaking Warheads, some Nerds, Sour Patch Kids. I'm not sure exactly what those are. Sour Patch Kids. Probably gummy bears, maybe? I don't know. Some Mike and Ike Berry Blast. Love Mike and Ikes. 
and some Skittle Sours. I guess she pays attention to the vlogs because I, I mentioned last time I went to uh, when we went to Mexico, I came back and I had three cartons of Marlboros. Marlboro. Marl. I call them Marlboros. Must be the French in me. And uh, I said how much I liked them, so she got me two uh, packets of friggin' Marlboro cigarettes. The this is the kind that we I had when I was in Mexico, I think, or was the box white? I can't remember. But this is the kind I had in Mexico, just the regular filtered cigarettes, and I think they I don't know I like the taste of them. I remember when I came back, I gave um, Adrian a pack, and he smoked like five of them and said he couldn't do it anymore. And he sent me a pack of menthols, which I, I do like menthols from time to time. I will admit, I do like menthols, and the best part about menthols is. Is nobody will dare bum a cigarette off you unless they like menthols if you aren't having a cigarette. That's freaking awesome. I guess she heard me talking about how I needed pen drives in my vlogs because she went ahead and sent me. <laughs> this is awesome. It's the red bird, my favorite angry bird. Uh, eight gigabytes. I know the red bird's her favorite bird too. She has uh, angry bird shirts and stuff and all sorts of red bird shirts. I only have the one red bird shirt, which is uh, where the whole shirt's red and it's got dude's face on it. That's awesome. And she sent me a great big box of the Keurig K-Cups. We got 14 freaking coffees in there. And it's the kind that I like, the Dunkin' Donuts. Now, I don't know, these. I, I think they taste great. Like, I love the Dunkin' Donuts coffee. Uh, at least out of the Keurig. I'd never actually have one from the shop, so once again, it could be different. I don't know. But right on. And she also sent me this. Let me take it out of the uh, package here. It says Paris, France, and it's an ashtray. This will be for ornamental use because, as you guys know, I don't smoke in the house, so I won't be using an ashtray. But uh, this will be more for uh, ornamental use. But that's freaking awesome. You got the Eiffel Tower on there and a bunch of other guys. That's pretty sweet. Thanks, big time, Redneck Nessa. If you guys haven't subscribed to her yet, you really should. Link will be in the the guy in the description. Uh, thanks big time for all that. Obviously you, uh, freaking love that coffee a lot. Because, holy crap, you really, 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 really didn't have to do that. That's crazy. Awesome. But, right on. I like it a lot. Well, I'm going to go ahead and make myself a Dunkin' Donuts coffee. And go and try out one of these Marlboro menthol cigarettes. Because I haven't had a menthol in a long time. And I didn't know Marlboro made them. Marlboro, whatever, you know. Anyway, let's get to cracking on the coffee. Just went outside, had a menthol. Pretty good, pretty good. Right now I'm just brewing up a Keurig, a Dunkin' Donuts. Cause I love that kind. And uh, gonna put this poop out. And uh, gonna go drink a coffee and comment on comments. Sounds like a pretty, pretty good day. Pretty good day for sure. Coffee's ready. Holy crap, does it smell good. Frig yeah. Alrighty, well, it's friggin' 2.30. I got a good, good stretch. I had a good coffee. Oh, uh, Dunkin' Donuts is friggin' amazing. So amazing, gurgling the rest back right freaking now. <sighs> well, it's snowing out. Fuck sakes. But uh, I'm gonna go make another coffee. And then we're gonna do. Flyer day, flyer day. Gotta look at sales on flyer day. See what kind of deals they have in the paper. Flyer day, flyer day. Gotta look at sales on flyer day. See what kind of deals they have in the paper. Flyer day, flyer day, yeah. Flyer day, flyer day, yeah. All the sales, all the sales. So much sales, love the sales. Told you that song was dicked. What are you doing? Holy shit. You're nuts. Freak sake, stop it. Sit. Ha. Sit, sit, sit. Sit, look pretty. Look pretty for the audience. <laughs> you can't. Before we do Flyer Day, I'm gonna give him a cookie. If I give him a cookie, I'm gonna give him a begging strip. Look at these things. They're freaking bacon for dogs. Okay, sit. What do you say? No, what do you say? Lay down, lay down, roll. That spin. Down. Ha, ha. <laughs> Come on. Hey, roll. 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 There you go. Hey, no, no, Oreo, Oreo, not on the carpet. Go eat that in your bed, because you're going to make a mess. He does make a mess. He's just such a sloppy eater. He'll have that gone in five seconds flat. Yep. 
Well, my coffee's ready, so let's go rock some flyers. All right, well, let's start off with staples. The big printing event. Oh, for freak's sakes. Oh, coupons, 75% off your purchase of printing, a printer priced $199 or more. Right on. Got a real nice, great, big, freaking industrial cannon here for sale. $124, regular $199, I'm assuming. 16 gig pen drive for eight bucks. It's not bad. Two terabyte hard drive, freaking portable hard drive, which means no power supply needed. Plug it into your computer and you're off to the races. 140 bucks. The Hewlett Packard Wi Fi Touch Mouse. Touch scroll high end technology. And all day comfort. Mmm. Wi Fi though, that's weird. Girlfriend was looking at this camera. She was thinking about picking it up for uh, our trip to Dominican. Because it's waterproof, freezer proof, shock proof, freaking all that crap. Yeah. Honestly, if I were to pick up a MacBook Pro, that's probably the one I would get. It's 13.3 inches, I think it's got the i5, 500 gig hard drive, 4 gigs of RAM, USB 3.0. Yeah, I'd probably just get that one there. That'd be more than what I need. I don't know why they show these refurbished freaking computers in here. They're not in the store. They're only available online. I don't know. Even though it says in-store only, special order at some some locations. It's usually special order at every location. Ah, doesn't matter. It's a piece of shit. Yeah, I got those gloves. They actually do work. Kind of, sort of want that for my iPad. But it's probably one of those things I'd use like once or twice and then never use again. Some interesting deals on some SD cards here. You know, they got the verbatims. 233X. Not sure what the actual speed is, it just says 233X, class 10, sure. I'd like to get this one here. That would definitely solve my problem with the Panasonic, which I'm filming with right now, but the other Panasonic. Oh, a 40 Dodo Shop. Oh no, it's a 40, uh, a freaking Adobe Photo, Photoshop Lite. Hmm, what the freak? Oh yeah, perfect. Ah, the ultimate field recorder. Just get a microphone and that guy and you're set. Well, because uh, flyers suck this week, we're going to move on to Walmart, which I have never done, I don't think. Save money, live better. Freaking Walmart. Thousands of items on rollback. Ooh. Oh, friggin' mini wheats and all sorts of brand-based cereals for $2.97. That's a good deal. I love those kind. Don't quite know what a tube is. What is it? Freaking yogurt or something? I don't know. Yo plot tubes and mini goes. Two bucks. Oh, perfect front. Felix pukes all over the place. Bounty, the quicker picker upper. Oh, cheese whiz, people. It adds personality. Oh, I love granola bars. Especially when they have that symbol on them. Wait, is that the no nuts? I think so. Can't tell. No, it says real chocolate. There's some of these that have no nuts that I can eat. Mmm, candy. Love Maynards. Freaking Swedish berries. I haven't had Eggo waffles in freaking forever. Mmm, craft dinner. Buck a box. People wonder why college students live off this shit. That's not bad. $1.25 for a two liter of Coke? Holy shit. Those are pretty, that's a pretty good price right there. Three bucks for a freaking VH steamer. Normally they're five bucks a piece. Oh, I've always wanted bunk beds. Son of a bitch. I'm assuming that's the fourth generation. Does she come with it? Just wondering. I figured I'd also run a grocery based flyer. Seeing how I don't really have much for flyers this week. So this is independent. This is where I usually go to pick up my chicken sometimes. And we'll see what kind of deals I have. I don't know if that's a good deal for, uh, for ribs, but $2.49 a pound. I guess that's not bad. Oh, friggin' yogurt. Love yogurt. Mmm, fresh steelhead trout fillets. Yummy. Naturally smoked flavored bacon. Oh, I'd love to pick up a pack of that, fry the whole son of a bitch up, and just gurgle it back. Mmm, pepperettes. That's not a bad price for freaking cooked ham. 
and that's per 100 grams of course, but that's not a bad price. Oh, the Tuesday special. On Tuesday, I should go there and pick this up. You get two chicken wedges or chicken tenders with potato wedges for two bucks. You can also get the 10 piece with two potato wedges for 10 bucks. Holy shit. Hmm, a nutritional shake. Vega One. Never heard of that crap before. I freaking love Vector cereal. It's so good. Oh, don't tell Felix about this deal. He'll be begging me for it. Two for four bucks on soft drinks here, two liters. Yeah, it's everything in Pepsi. Right on. Freaking Greek yogurt. Never had that before. I wonder how it is. And finally, we go back to the classics. Friggin' Future Shop. Intercept Great Savings. Exciting stuff. Oh, we got the full LG bundle here. Freaking uh, 55 inch TV with a 1100 watt smart 3D Blu ray home theater system. Oh, so you get like all this shit and the TV for fifteen hundred freaking dollars. Oh, and it comes with Blu-ray movies and six pairs of 3D glasses. Oh, damn, that's a nice TV. There's like no freaking bezel around it. I like that. I wonder what makes this Rocketfish freaking HDMI cable any better than the one I bought at the three dollar for three bucks at the, uh, the dollar bin or dollar store or whatever Dollarama you know mine's gold plated so yeah I don't know 10 bucks for 16 gigs here I think the deal at uh, Staples is better I was gonna pick one of these up for my MacBook when I was using it as a PC but I don't have a MacBook anymore sad panda sure do love my Keurig this one here is programmable apparently though so you can like set it up at night to like wake you up in the morning and have a coffee ready. I don't need that. I'm just gonna go downstairs, pop a cake up in it, press the button and walk away. Alrighty people, well it's 3.30, it's time to head her off to work. I'm gonna rock a piss and take off. Let's do this. Well, she's not as cold out today as she has been, but uh, as you can tell maybe, it's snowing like a son of a bitch right now. That pretty much sucks. Oh well, let's get off to work and uh, get this final shift over with for the week. This should be pretty awesome. Should be pretty awesome indeed. Alrighty people, well we made it to work and it is currently 3.48 p.m. Yes, I know my car is filthy, but I'm not gonna clean it till we have warmer. What the fuck was that? I'm not gonna clean it till we have warmer weather because uh, frig it. And it's gonna be hard as hell to clean. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna clean off the dash and the windshield and all that shit. On a later date, frig that, I'm at work now, so I'm going to head her inside, carry on with this night, and I'll talk to you guys on my break if I have something to talk about. So until then, peace the frig out. Damn, we sure did get a lot of snow in the past four hours. Holy shit. Yeah, people, it's lunchtime. I came outside for a cigarette. There's nothing going on. It's been pretty slow tonight. Good times, good times. It's been, you know, getting shit did and stuff. So far, so good. So... Right on. Freaking wish every night could be like this, but they can't, so they aren't. Ah oh well. So far it's been perfect. Can't complain. I was gonna go to the beer store tonight and pick up my beer. Frig it, I'll go tomorrow. I don't feel like drinking tonight anyway. Yep, I said it. I don't feel like drinking tonight. Pretty crazy, right? A lot of people are wondering about that video I posted last night about me lighting a candle. Wondering what the frig it's about. Well, if you find out, let me know, because I don't even understand it. A couple of days ago, YouTuber yeah, Happy Cabby posted a video about a collab and basically said if you want to get in on a collab, PM them and he'll send you the details. That video was part of a collab. That's it, that's all. No idea what the hell it's going to do, but frig it. Decided to make it anyway. Anyway, I'm freezing my balls off and I really got a rock of piss, so I'm going to head her back inside. Talk to you guys later. Peace out. Well, it's freaking midnight, people. Temperature got warmer and the car is a snowbank. I just cleaned that windshield too, like, it is snowing like a son of a bitch out right now. So where's Bobby? We got snow again, just so you know. I'm supposed to do this all weekend. Looks like I get to bust my blower out clean the driveway. It's gonna be fun. Anyway, it's time to head her home, so let's pitter patter and have at her and get her asses home. This is gonna be one hell of a drive. Let's do this.
people, I'm home now. It's friggin' 12.30. What a bitch of a drive home, eh? Holy shit. I'm out here with Oreo. He's rocking a shit. He's totally pooping. Yeah, just giving her. And it's still snowing like a son of a gun out. So, right on. I think Oreo's looking for his icicle. Not gonna find it. What's he doing over there? He's eating ice. What a dog. Look at his face. He's jamming his face in snowbanks. Oreo. 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 Oh, hey, he's busy. He's got things. Well, we're going to head her inside and call her quits for tonight and carry on tomorrow. Right on. All right, well, people, it's freaking... 1.15 in the morning. It literally sounds like there's a bass cannon going off in this house right now. There's a Camera's not gonna pick it up because it's too, but it's happening, it's happening. The girlfriend can hear it, I can hear it, so obviously it's happening. Anyway, I'm shutting the video down here. This house is dicked, frig it. Uh, if you like today's video, you know what to do. Go ahead and hit the like button. Let me know you like the video and I like that. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, you know where to leave in the comment section below. And until the last time, people, keep on vlogging. I uh, found out that uh, the address was mistyped. So this is pretty funny. I'm gonna resend buddy a shirt, but uh, this is pretty funny because somewhere out there, there's a guy walking around with this on his chest, and he doesn't have a freaking clue what the hell it means. That's pretty funny. I, I freaking laugh at that. I really should put the website you know, the link so that when if that does happen, you know, some mysterious person might come across it and go, "Hey, what's this link? Maybe I should check this out." New subscriber. Then people say it's illegal to buy subscribers. Well, this is an accident. Really? You're gonna be like this. Doesn't he look like a black fluffy jelly bean? Stop it. Doesn't he look like a black fluffy jelly bean? Or maybe a caterpillar? Down. Why are you gonna be like this? Stop that. Stop that. Okay, now. Here's my black fluffy jelly bean. Snorts a lot, too. Oh, my peckerhead. Saw the dog out. Because he had to go potty. Because he's going nuts. So right now, I'm just rendering up that tacket footage. Trying to make it into manageable videos. To uh, snow about the YouTubes. And uh, chatting with people and stuff. And holy, holy. I just went and 